In this video we're going to take a look at doors and windows and their phase setting relative to the wall in which they are in. So I'm going to start by selecting all the windows and all the doors and then I'm going to use ID Query to look at some of the phased based properties. Um, the simplest way to do that is just to type the word phase and then um, you can go to the phase created. This is going to be, if I pick a name here, that'll be the phase of the door or the window. Um, and then we want, we're only looking at the ones that are new, but that have been created in walls that have an existing phase. So we're going to look at these. Oops, I forgot one important step, which is to follow this instruction here, control select. So here's the phase created for the wall, and then I have to hit the control key and do name. Okay, so then here's the one Oh, that's not the one I want, but I can add this one. You can add a third property. There we go. Okay, so we're looking for the phase created is new, but the wall is existing. So in this case, it's only these that meet that criteria. I'll hit select, and there we have the ones that meet that criteria. And then, of course, um, in the newer versions of Explorer, uh, for 16, 17, 18, you can also um, load them as a saved selection. So edit these new doors and windows. And then you can unselect them and double click to zoom to them. Here's one of them. And then here's the other one. And then, if, or you can select all of them at once, and if you needed to modify the phase, you, know, you could do, do that here of all of them at once. And that's looking at phases using the ID query button within Explorer.